so guys uh other state assembly threatens to cancel deal with innocent motors over breach of contracts hope you know that there was a time innocent motors uh, donated fire fighting trucks to other states to comment uh, governor alex oti for believing in nigerian made you know innocent vehicles manufacturing company limited donated a firefighting truck to abia state governor um, while commending governor alex oti for believing in nigerian made products you know while presenting the truck to governor alex oti the chairman and managing director of the indigenous vehicle manufacturing company that's chief innocent chukoma that's the owner of um, innocent motors said it was his company's contribution uh, in response to the fire incident that happened in Aba a couple of months ago, as well as a show of appreciation for good works, you know, that Governor Alex Oti is doing in Abia State. So I heard that the factory was born into ashes. Okay, that was why Innocent had to donate uh, firefighting trucks to Abia State to help them fight future fires that is going to happen in abia state he said i'm donating this one to the states because of the good works uh, the governor is doing in abia state to help in fighting future fires so guys this is what is happening now no abia assembly is threatening to cancel deal with innocent motors over breach of contracts you know there was um the, the there was an agreement that innocent that innocent motors was going to uh, uh, construct uh, uh, vehicles for every lawmaker in Abia State, and now is not keeping to his is not keeping to his words. He's not keeping to his own part of the agreement. The money has been paid to him, and now he doesn't bring any vehicle to any lawmaker. Is not keeping uh, part of his agreement with the government. Now, the Abia Assembly has threatened to cancel the deal with Innocent Motors over breach of contract. So, guys, the Abia House of Assembly has threatening to terminate its contract with Innocent Vehicles Manufacturing Limited for allegedly failing to fulfill its agreement to produce vehicles for all the lawmakers. So the Speaker of the House, uh, Right Honorable Emmanuel Emerua, announced this on Thursday in Uma. He are doing a media interaction marking the one-year anniversary of the 8th Assembly. So Emerua expressed regret that members have not received their vehicles a year after their inauguration. He noted that the preference for innocent vehicles was driven by uh, Governor Alex Oti's initiatives to promote local products. So, Emerua stated, stated that uh, Innocent had received full payments to produce the vehicles, but has failed more than 10 times to deliver them. So, guys, he stated that so far Innocent has not been able to produce or perform its own side of the agreement. At this point, we are on the verge of terminating that contract and asking for our money back if he does not perform within the next 15 days this house is very serious about it and they cannot continue pacifying them after one year when the money has already been paid in full so presenting the one year scorecard of the eighth assembly the speaker announced that five out of 15 bills had been passed into law he, he also highlighted that the House had also made 40 resolutions, received 46 petitions and handled 55 motions. He emphasized that uh, the Assembly's high level of activity expressing confidence that even more would be accomplished by this time next year. So the Speaker also noted the peaceful nature of the 8th Assembly and its positive relationship with the Executive. Now, this is what you should know. The government of Abia State entered a partnership with Innocent Motors where it purchased most of the vehicles used mm -hmm. by the state's government officials. A move aimed at promoting uh, local production in the auto industry. 
Now, the partnership led the governor of Abia State, Dr. Alex Oti, to ask the chairman of the company to establish another vehicle manufacturing plant in the state. So innocent vehicles usually generate the bulk of their revenue from contracts to the government and corporate, uh, corporate organizations rather than, you know, B2C. The company says the administration of the President Buhari has enjoyed significant federal government support through purchases of vehicles for ministries and government agencies. Even the military is not left out as the army had made notable purchases from the company. So guys, that's the reset happening in Abia State as um, Abia Assembly threatens to cancel uh, the deal they had with innocent motors over breach of contracts so guys you have come to the end of this video please if you are new to this channel please do well to subscribe like and also drop your comments below see you guys in the next video